If you are one of the millions of Americans who struggle with back pain, you might find yourself grabbing over-the-counter pain medication like ibuprofen. But Melanie Lawson tells us those medications may actually prolong your pain. Bending, sitting, lifting, movements you don't think about until they cause you serious pain. So about 80% of people in their lifetime will experience low back pain. Of those people, a good portion will experience pain that lasts for three months or longer. In fact, 16 million Americans have chronic back pain. Many rely on common non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medications for relief. Now a new study suggests those pills might cause the pain to stick around longer. Researchers say that happens because the drugs temporarily relieve inflammation, but don't treat the root cause of the back problem. Plus, Cleveland Clinic says other recent studies show that daily use of an anti-inflammatory can lead to stomach problems, high blood pressure, and kidney damage. Instead of reaching for back pain pills, first, some medical guidelines suggest people start with non-drug treatments like exercise, yoga, physical therapy, heat, or massage. Pain management specialists say if doctors don't help patients find relief from back pain, things can get worse. It's been linked to um, depression, sleep problems, anxiety. So having something that can effectively treat these patients who have been suffering really does improve their quality of life. Melanie Lawson, Channel 4, The Local Station.